Hello everyone, welcome or welcome back. I'm Melanie Kate Love, the self-love makeover artist, and I teach beautiful, soulful women just like you learn to nourish and heal your energetic blockages through the delicious power of self-love and angel guidance. Now today, I wanted to talk you through my number one weight loss tip and how I have managed to lose 10 kilos, which is kind of around three to four dress sizes or 22 pounds. Now, this is something that I am super proud of. And once I learned this trick, trick it was like revolutionary. I was like, oh, good Lord. Why doesn't anybody teach you that? You know, people I have found on my journey just give you like, a quick fix. It's like, oh, take this weight loss pill or put this thing around your tummy and you have abs. It's like, actually, when you address the root of the problem, it's like, why are you overweight? What are you trying to eat your feelings away from? Like, why, why are you self-sabotaging yourself? What happened to you when you were younger that has made you who you are today? That's a tough one. It's like, there has been a blockage within your soul that has created who you are today and it's manifested in your body. And to me, I use form as a food as a form of self-sabotage, coping mechanism, whatever you want to call it. And I have learned to identify what that trigger was. I've learned how to heal it. I've learned how to thrive from it. And I've learned to turn my pain into a beautiful success story. And I know that you watching this right now can totally do it. My number one secret is self-love. Love truly heals all blockages. And when you can send love to the situation that has broken you down and made you feel useless and made you feel like the only thing that you can do is to eat in order to... I used to, I would used to say that I used to eat my feelings and I would, you know, overeat for the fact that I wanted to cause pain on myself. That sounds so sick when I say that out loud, but I use food as that form to really hurt myself. When I was able to identify the blockage, because you know, by me saying this, you know exactly, you've pinpointed a time in your life that has caused you hurt. I know I have a friend who, she is overweight because of what has happened when she was younger and her mother was never the mother that she needed her to be. And there was issues with her relationship with her dad and her mum together and, you know, family things happen. And just know that you are not defined by your past. I want to make that 100% clear. You are not defined by the past. You have the power to change exactly the state that you were in. I want you to repeat this. Are you ready? I am where I am and it's okay. Say it. I am where I am and it's okay. I am where I am and it's enough. I am where I am and it's okay because it's all that I've got. And I want you to surrender your pain to the universe. The perfect way to do that is to check out my release blockages playlist on my YouTube channel. Three videos in particular that I talk to you about is all about three different letter writing techniques that can help you release that pain and help you to set yourself free. It's like when you, when you are overwhelmed and you're overweight and you don't really like, to me, overeating is not a form of self-love. Overeating is the form of like self-sabotage and manipulation and pain. And you want to inflict that on yourself. When you love yourself, you do not make those choices. And as you start to reprogram your mind with high vibrational thoughts, which you can achieve through listening to or like downloading my self-love starter kit, the link is in the description. I teach you three strategies to help you vibrate in the frequency of love. One is like a morning mindset audio where I program your mind for success. I literally make you feel like you're the most beautiful person in the whole flipping entire world. The second one is like um, five minutes to bliss. It's just like a five minute guided meditation when you're feeling overwhelmed and you just like got your shoulders up and you want, and you just feel that sense of like, oh, it's okay. You know, like when you're underneath the water and you're trying to swim to the top of the, um, of the water to be like, you know, you just get that breath. And the other one is a self-love practices workout where you actually get to identify through this work, the worksheets that I've created, what does self-love look like for you and identifying like a time where you were truly the most happiest and how you can get back there. So I know that you're watching this video because something 
has sparked within your intuition and you're either truly curious about how I did it and how you can recreate it for yourself or maybe you know of someone that is struggling with this issue and just know that when you surrender to the process and you release those blockages and you start visualizing the person that you know deep down that you were destined to be and you start visualizing that and you feel the emotions associated with it as if you're already the person that you know you're destined to be it's law of attraction it's like it's a law it can it has to happen and that's what I started doing. I started laying down, so sound totally weird. And because I've got fat on my leg, if I put my legs up, like if this is my back and I put my legs up like this against the wall, the fat would go down and I could actually see the shape of my legs. And it's crazy to say, but I can see that now. It's like I find that through the power of self-love and releasing the blockages, and feeling proud with exactly where you are, it's like the universe just gives you little glimpses and it's like the most beautiful thing to know that you're shopping for new clothes because your stuff doesn't fit because, not because you put on weight, it's because, well, that could be if whatever spectrum you're at, but if you've lost weight and you're like, oh my gosh, I need to buy new clothes because everything makes me feel not good about myself. and. That's what's happened to me recently, and that's probably why I'm making this video, is because recently I've been shopping for so many clothes. I haven't been exercising. I would say I do like 10 minutes of yoga once every like two weeks, and I've been trying to go for more walks on the beach. Well, more so now that I have moved to the beach. Um, and I've had like 80% of a new wardrobe. And it is the most liberating feeling to put clothes on, like, and to have shorts on and to not hear your bloody thighs rubbing together, you know, and, and to not have like when you're wearing shorts for your, um, your shorts to get caught up in between your legs. You guys who know about this probably are like, oh my God, now I totally relate. Like it's such a liberating feeling. And what's so beautiful is that self-love is not a destination. It's a journey. And the journey is just so beautiful. So when you have the strategies and the tools to know how to release blockages and how to nourish and heal your body, mind and soul, you become unstoppable and you become the person that you know that you have always been destined to be. Anyways, my love, I just wanted to leave you with that if you are struggling on your, your journey, whether it's weight loss or whatever, and you're looking for clarity and guidance, book yourself a private reading because I help give you the angel guidance that has been like wanting to be delivered to you for such a long time, but you're just not in the right vibration to hear it. So click the link in my description, book yourself a private reading. I would absolutely love to help you out. I know how this feels, and I know that this is something that you are going to break free of, and I know that you're gonna rise above. And if you feel the emotions associated with who you want to be, as if you're already that person, then you, my love, can have it in your reality. And I'm living proof that it is possible. And to be able to not only look better, but feel healthier, which in turn has helped create a healthy body, mind, and soul. I am forever grateful that I was overweight. I am so glad that that happened to me because I would not be the person that I am today. And I wouldn't be made aware of like the importance of releasing blockages from your childhood or an ex-partner or whatever was that situation that brought you down. It is okay because that is divinely orchestrated because it's the universe giving you an opportunity to thrive, to grow and to heal. And I am so excited for your journey. I am so excited to hear about your self-love makeover in the description. Just let, let me know, comment below. Let me know where are you on your journey and how has self-love impacted you? Um, Cause I think, I honestly believe to the core of my soul that love heals all blockages. When we can identify the blockage, we send love to it, we feel the pain. You need to feel the pain. That is like a, a stage that so many people bypass. It's why so many people go straight from a bad relationship onto antidepressants or, you know, 
I don't know, there's so much involved with it, but I'm here to help you. If you need it, book a reading, download my self-love starter kit, comment below. Oh my gosh, there's so many things to do. And yeah, I can't wait to hear from you in the comments. As always, I'll be writing back to you for the first hour after this video from 6 a.m. to 7 a.m. Australian Eastern Standard Time. After that, I may get a chance to comment back or maybe it's just a love heart to let you know that I've read it. Anyways, my love, thank you so much for taking the time to watch this video. I'm sending you so much love and I want you to know that you are a fabulous person. You're wonderful, you're creative, you are unique and you can heal those blockages. You can heal that pain through the power of self-love. Anyways, I love you and I will see you next episode.